Well, what would you do to better protect our citizens? After a week marred by violent crime, that was one of the key questions at a forum today for the top candidates for Honolulu mayor. Kia TV 4's Denby Fawcett joins us more in tonight's Commitment 2010 story. Denby? Yes, this was at a mayoral forum sponsored by the Honolulu Rotary Club. Former Honolulu prosecutor and mayoral candidate Peter Carlisle had some of the most concrete ideas for increasing public safety. As mayor, you're in a unique when the question was asked about reducing crime, Rod Tam answered first, saying he'd encourage more participation in citizens' watch groups like he did in Chinatown last year. As mayor, I would work with the prosecutor's office and the people of the different communities to safeguard your community. Former Honolulu prosecutor Peter Carlisle said he'd like more prison space and he'd increase emphasis on arresting minor criminals before their crimes escalated to more serious offenses. What we really need to do more than anything else in the criminal justice system is prevent, prevent, prevent. And the only way you do that is with significantly addressing the basic quality of life type crimes such as theft, such as um, prostitution, such as graffiti. If we can start dealing with those things successfully, then the bigger crimes will go away. Pano Spreviduro said he'd manage crime-fighting resources better. You probably have seen it that sometimes there is a minor case of a traffic accident or some minor arrest. Four, five, six police cars piled up. Is there all this energy necessary to handcuff a junior on a moped? We got to think about it. Maybe these resources have to be uh, relocated. Acting Mayor Kirk Caldwell said the Hanneman administration has done a good job of getting resources for the police, but the public has to help. Now, the police can't do it by themselves. They just can't. So community policing, neighborhood watches, those kinds of things, the city works with the police to make that happen so that they can be the eyes and ears for the police is a very important thing. Caldwell also said he'd push for more security cameras in dangerous areas. Now tonight at 10, we'll have a report about one of the more interesting questions the mayoral candidates were asked at the forum today. The candidates were taken aback when one of the Rotary members asked them to talk about their own personal flaws. Tune in to KITV for tonight to hear how they answered. Back to you, Laura. All right. Thanks, Denby.